Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing a collective clothing haul. A few things to address. I am obviously really sick, but I've just been uploading a lot of makeup videos recently. I don't want to just like do just makeup. I want my channel to be a little bit of everything. I really didn't want to upload like a fourth makeup video in a row. I've picked up quite a bit of clothes recently and I just thought that I would share it with you. The other day I saw Nicole Renee do like a collective like fashion haul. I just really wanted to do it and I was also inspired by her doing neutral glam. I never do like neutral glam like this. I always do like either colors or nothing at all. Let's just get started. Most of this is from like the past two weeks um, and then there's some things that I actually picked up like a few months back whenever there was like a swimsuit sale but they're still like available now so I just thought that I would throw them in here since I haven't mentioned them. I'm really gonna try and step up my style for some of this here because normally I wear like the same things like I wear flowy shorts and then like a t-shirt um and the flowy shorts are cute but then I never wear like anything else so yeah I just want to like embrace the summer style you know I'm gonna start with Target and Walmart since it's only like two things and hopefully my voice isn't toodling <laughs> from Target I got this avocado shirt it's like a really cute avocado shirt like it's gray with a bunch of avocados all over it i do have an avocado shirt that looks kind of like this but it's white and it says guac and roll i really don't ever wear it because it's white and it's see-through and i don't really like it and that's super cute and i could literally wear this with a pair of shorts i got so then i also got these fox socks there's a few graphic socks if you will in this video because i just love cute socks my winter sandals are burks and i always wear socks with them i call them my winter sandals because i don't like wearing like closed toe shoes so i want my toes to always be open but obviously in the winter slash spring slash fall it's chilly enough to wear burks and socks that's kind of like my thing from walmart i got these black sweatpants and they come like to like the jogger kind of material but they have pockets which i'm so glad about and a drawstring these are from the athletic works brand and these are small but like they're so stretchy and they're like a really thick nice material sweatpants with like the tight ankle i feel like you can make a little more cute but they're so comfortable i literally wore them two days in a row now on to forever 21 forever 21 and airy are basically where like i got like most of the things so yeah i'm gonna start with the cute socks because the uh first ones are these black and white striped socks with these little cute peaches on them and then i got these if you don't already know i'm obsessed with avocados and this is like a little avocado working out it says avocado i got these with grilled cheese on them. My goal this year, as I said, was to like dress stylish, but is to go out of my comfort zone because one thing I won't ever do is like show my stomach with a shirt, even if it is just like a little bit and it like raises up if I'm like doing this and it raises up, I will like pull it down. But like I've tried to be more like laid back about it. So I got some shirts that show my stomach. <laughs> and I actually got like lettuce to sleeve shirts. Like what? This is this cute lavender light pink and black striped lettuce sleeve like crop top it's definitely more like body fitting and then this one kind of fun i wouldn't have ever like chosen this because of like the neon shades but it's like yellow orange and blue i really like it so cute this one definitely covered a little bit more and it's a little more comfortable like in the armpit region and i got these shorts because i told you that i live in flowy shorts they're ten dollars i don't have a pair that's like this Color. This is the thing that I'm most excited about. I've already worn it like four times since I got it. I call it a grandma sweater. I got this in medium to be like extra big, but it's like super holy and oversized and grungy. The reason I got this was for like a beach sweater because I really wanted like a super holy knit sweater that doesn't really keep you too hot, but also like kind of keeps the wind off you, but it's mostly just for the look. <laughs> And I love it. Like, I just thought that I would wear it at the beach, but I've literally worn it so many times. I love it. It's, like, very chunky, which I wanted. And now I want, like, 20 jillion chunky sweaters. I'm going to go ahead and mention the things from Airy. They had, like, a huge swim sale, like, in February or something. And I was like, whoa. I already know, like, my size and all these because I got swimsuits last year. The style I like it is high-waisted. It's just, like, so much more comfortable because it covers your belly button. It just makes it seem like a lot more coverage. Your butt is basically fully covered, so I just don't like cheeky bathing suits where you can see your whole butt. But that's your style, like it looks cute on some people, but for me, I like being covered. I don't like it showing your crotch also because that's pretty disgusting. I just like being comfortable and covered. The only colors that I had last year was an olive green and a black, so obviously those aren't like summery colors. So now this year I have like actual color, and I'm so excited. So I have the lilac ones, 
These ones I think are called like Harvest or something. Rusty orange, very pretty blue ones. I had plenty of tops from last year, but I got this one and it's kind of tiny. Like it's a lot tinier than my other ones and I got the same size as my other scoop neck one because I really liked that scoop neck one. But this is a little small, not gonna lie. To most people, this wouldn't be small at all. I'm just not used to showing my chest, like even this part of my chest. And I literally have no boobs, so it's not like my boobs are like popping out. I just really wanted this like gingham kind of style. That's what it looked like on the website at least. It's not really as like whatever's I thought, but it's still cute. The reason I went like to Airy this time was because I wanted these bralettes. They have like the bralette material here and they actually have a really thin like pad lining and I thought that it was gonna be like a really big chunky pad like a regular bra but it's like literally like the thinnest thing ever which I love. I have the black one on right now. The only thing I don't like is that these are like bra straps but I don't really mind it because they go up like this. They're super comfortable though. I do recommend you go a size up though because I got an extra small which is the size that I'm in my other bralettes and they hurt my neck so bad I had to return them and go and get a small and it feels so much better like it doesn't really feel like I'm wearing a bra. They have like all sorts of colors. I have a blue and green one of like the older bralettes um, and I literally wear them all the time. Like I don't wear bras. <laughs> Like, I just wear bralettes, so I wanted to get ones that are neutral. I would normally never, like, buy, like, an undershirt tank top from Aerie because it's, like, $20 for a tank top. All of these stores always have sales. This is a white tank top. It has buttons down it, which I love because black, I can wear, like, a plain tank top with shorts or whatever because it's black. But, like, with white, I feel like I just can't have it plain. I like how that they have, like, that accent. And they have, like, a bunch of other colors in this, which I really wanted to get. But I was like, no, I can't. I can wear this with that, and it, the straps don't show, and also, like, you can barely see it through. Or I can wear the black one and have, like, show through, and, you know. I also got these a while back whenever I got jeans and underwear, which I'm not going to be showing in these, but these are, like, paper bag shorts. They have pockets, and I just love them. It's going to be cute with, like, my avocado shirt. The way I tried it on was a black tank top with a gray sweater, or just the black tank top, obviously, if it's hot. Oh, and then also, whenever I was returning those bralettes, I found this sweatshirt in the clearance section, and these are normally, like, $45 and this was on sale for 17 It feels like it'd be thinner, but it's actually really warm and it's like so soft I just love this and I love this color like yeah, here I am wearing my gingerbread pants and it's <laughs> Mar March. Oh, it's April. Goodness girl. So yeah, those are all the things that I got um, in the past few weeks slash a few things from the past few months. I hope that this was a good switch up from a makeup video and also you get to see like a glimpse into my style. My style is kind of like a little bit of fashion but mostly like comfort and security and modesty because I just I don't like being flashy. I just don't like all eyes being on me. I like to be comfortable like I don't want to be in any outfit and feel really insecure anything like that. So yeah, tell me down below what stores you shop at for the summertime and on a budget. I really hope y'all enjoyed this video. If you did, I would love it if you subscribed down below and please give this video a big thumbs up. It means so much to me. Thank you so much for watching. Bye! I really hope my voice wasn't too annoying.